All of our students are trained in core skills that will equip them to do the multidisciplinary PhDs. These range from core computing skills to an understanding of the social and industrial context that they're working within. The great thing about being a PhD in Horizon is you're actually part of a, a national research hub for digital economy research. And that means within the university we've got a network of about 70 supervisors from different disciplines who are all contributing to this big melting pot with debates about technology going on and they might be in your supervision team. We also get to meet and uh, work with people in other CDTs and other universities who are doing similar or very different work really. Our students might do anything from learn about the fundamentals of computing that can uh, help them to develop mobile applications to understanding the social context in which those technologies might be used. You've got people from uh, psychologists to computer scientists, you've got people from uh, lawyers to engineers, areas that you're not an expert on but potentially your colleagues and your friends are. The PhD in Horizon is a, a four-year PhD and the first phase of it is really spent exploring new disciplinary perspectives. And that time scale and the ability to kind of broaden perspectives, that's not something you get from the conventional PhD route. Our industry sponsors for the CDT include um, organisations such as the Rail Safety and Standards Board, um, the BBC and Experian. Not only do we have um, internships that we can do, but we're always encouraged, even during academic group work, to engage with the real world, to go and find out how our ideas actually fit in with the real world. We won a competition, so we've benefited by the opportunity that the university has to support new entrepreneurs and then we have other opportunities to get together and meet through retreats and such like. First languages of people who use the internet. All of our students in Horizon will work with an external partner who will be involved in their supervision team. That partner might be from major industry or might be from a third sector or charitable organisation. They get that value from seeing the cohort of students as a whole as well as the specific student that they're working with directly.